Space. The final frontier. Wait, that's the wrong script. Hold on, where'd I put it? Oh, there it is, found it. Okay. <clears throat> Space is the most strange place known to man. Hell, even that's an understatement. With its endless amount of, theoretically speaking, everything. Planets are part of solar systems, which are part of star clusters, which are part of galaxies, which are part of galaxy clusters, which are, well, you get my point. No matter what direction in space you look, there is always something to learn. Today's topic is only covering one of these many anomalies. Black holes are defined as a region of space having a gravitational field so intense that no matter or radiation can escape. Oh yes, that includes light itself. So, what would happen if you were to fall into a black hole? Before we get into that, I just want to say that this channel has been an incredible experience and has helped me discover passions that I never thought I would enjoy. Seeing this channel go somewhere is such an amazing dream that I'd love to see come true. With your help, it can happen. So make sure to do Matthew and I in a favor and hit that subscribe button. Alright, enough shameless promotion, back to the video. To put our question bluntly, you'd be dead in seconds. The mere moment you pass the event horizon, your body would start to go through a process known as spaghettification. As the name suggests, the parts of your body closest to the space anomaly will be pulled apart very vigorously from the furthest parts because of the intense gravitational pull, basically turning you into some sort of space noodle, doomed to the fate that is dead. But let's put that all besides the point. What if somehow, some way, humans created technology so advanced to the point where they could enter a black hole safely? What would happen? To be completely honest, no one really knows for sure what'll happen, but many scientists, and I mean many, have theorized the possibilities. So let's talk about some of the top ones. So if a black hole quote unquote sucks, then would the opposite be a white hole that blows? Now as crazy as that sounds, it's not entirely far-fetched. According to Wikipedia, the definition of a white hole is as follows. A hypothetical region of space-time and singularity which cannot be entered from the outside, although energy, matter, and light can escape from it. In retrospect, the opposite of a black hole. The singularity of a white hole pushes all sources of energy away from it with a force stronger than anything imaginable. To understand how going into a black hole would spit you out of a white hole, we have to understand how wormholes work. Now, imagine on a piece of paper, you write two dots on opposite ends. Now, imagine that the pencil you're holding is a spacecraft. In space, the two dots are thousands of light years apart, and there's no possible way to get from point A to point B without spending an infinite amount of energy. Or is there? This is where the laws of physics become a little strange per se. Take the paper and fold the two points on top of one another. Boom. You just created a wormhole. Now how a wormhole even forms is a topic for a whole other video, but that's the crash course of what a wormhole does. I'm sure you're putting the data together already, but in case you aren't, let me help you out. This theory assumes that black holes are in fact wormholes, and that going too close to a black hole then transport you to a white hole. Now, who even knows where the white hole even is? Weird, right? So, if you thought that was weird, you're not going to like this next black hole theory, because it has to do with the entire universe itself. The most common theory of the birth of the universe is the Big Bang, but what about before that? Many experts believe that the Big Bang started from one infinitely dense and infinitely hot point. You know what else shares that exact description? That's right, a singularity. And most of the time, those are created when a star reaches the end of its lifetime and becomes a black hole. The alternative was being a neutron star or a supernova. When that singularity is made, when that infinitely dense point is created, a universe is born.
created an inescapable loop of universes dying and being born. You're probably wondering what this has to do with falling into a black hole, which, by the way, you're more than right to think. No, 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 before you click off and dislike for being misleading, allow me to explain. If every black hole is a new universe, then wouldn't it only make sense that somehow getting to the newly created universe could be possible by entering that black hole? Now I know that only raises more questions like, how old is the universe? Does that universe follow the same laws of science as ours? Would that mean we live inside a black hole? As much as I'd love to answer those questions in detail, I want to make sure this video stays under two pages of script. Especially since it's currently midnight and I didn't eat dinner so this video could go out on time. Anyways, I really want to hear all of your opinions on this type of content. So make sure to leave a like, comment if you enjoyed it, or even if you didn't. A lot of time went into this project so any support is appreciated. Subscribe, turn on notifications so you're aware when we upload. Thanks for watching, catch y'all later.